So the first thing you have to understand is that moving to a digital currency is a very straightforward thing yep. to do. Uh, people call them, people call them, and the, the two things can interact, of course. Some people call them stable coins, some people call them, you know, the Chinese are working on their own. Taking a, a currency called Ripple that you might hear in the banking sector. Oh, it could be a currency even like uh, Ripple has an alternative. It's just in a safe, verifiable ability to do it, know your customer and AML, take that down. That's a very valuable thing for us. And then you just ripple that through the industry. And we, we used to quote that we could ask them to destroy every dollar. We could, we could pay them to reprint the money. With the Colombian government's National Land Agency, creating the first decentralized land registry launched into production nationwide. XRPL technology is fantastic, but we wanted to help expand its functionality to provide a broader foundation for the future. Know what you hold? On-demand liquidity. Where was Gary Gensler? Enjoy the ride, pal. If you got some bags, welcome to the party. Welcome back to some more. Moon o'clock news. Get that breakfast. Get that popcorn ready because we got some straight extra, extra bullishness. Shout out to Lady Sub. Appreciate you stopping by. Stuffing some bags. Go ahead. Throw on those pilot shades. Those moon suits. Let's go full speed. Full throttle into the cryptoverse and we got the total global cryptocurrency market cap today at 1.16 trillion down about 1.4 percent in the past 24 hours we got xrp currently still in the number six spot right around 39 cents down one and a half percent in the past 24 hours we got xlm right around nine and a half cents up about 1.6 in the past 24 we got btc 24,484 eth right around 16 17 hundo we got flare networks here right around four almost five cents up about 15.3 percent in the past 24 and we got songbird here still right around one cent down almost two percent in the past 24 crypto giant coinbase is expected to report a loss of almost 600 million in q4 could we see another exchange go down riz xrp ripple investor glenn hutchins sec j clayton and gary cohen state of our security markets talking payments XRP. So the first thing you have to understand is that moving to a digital currency is a very straightforward thing yep. to do. Uh, people call them, people call them, and the, the two things can interact, of course. Some people call them stable coins, some people call them, you know, the Chinese are working on their own. Taking that thing on paper and turning it into a digitized thing is a very straightforward thing to do. Uh, and it's only, and today, the vast majority of money in the world is already digital because it's just electronic entries in banks and central banks. Yep. So the notion that it's some big revolutionary thing, mm -hmm. well, I can take 8%. By the way, Ken Rogoff's book, The End of Cash, says that you, the 80% 80 to 90% of US $100 bills are or, used in organized crime and tax evasion. By the, so the, the thing that's most useful to the bad guys is cash. It's the ultimate sort of uh, you know, anonymized security. But anyway, so that's a straightforward, easy thing to do. It should be done. And kind of, we just got to get, get, get there. Agree. Right. That's the end. That's that's easy. Amen. Uh, now, if you talk about the whole crypto kind of world, um, we, we uh, I got it. I got to this from the kind of the payments thing because I've been looking for a way in which we could take the cost of payments down by ninety nine percent. The way we're taking out the cost of trading and securities in the payments world, uh, we use the, the term the uh, we oftentimes use the term of the payments rails. So it's the credit card rails, it's checking rails, there's the Fed wire rails. So let's take to understand how I think to think about the cryptocurrency world. Um, is there are three parts of it, the blockchain, the, um, co the, the token, and the protocol. Uh, and the three of them operate together to create one solution, one integrated solution that has the capacity to, to revolutionize the way we move things of value around the world. Let me, let me use a railroad analogy to make the XRP, the only rails you need, whatever it is, it's going to need a bridge to the other side. XRP, hidden in plain sight. In 1964, the minimum wage was 590% silver quarters. In 2021, 590% silver quarters have a melt value of 2334. We don't need minimum wages. We need sound money. Warren Davidson says, fix the money, fix the world. So much of what divides us is a manipulated distraction from a rigged system of money. Free the standard. Drain the swamp. We got XRP, Crypto Wolf, Ripple, Solana Foundation, GBBC, and others form a partnership to promote crypto solutions for climate change. XRP, the greenest of them all. 
Gary Gensler says more than 90% of retail investors' marketable orders are routed to a small group of off-exchange wholesalers. I think that the retail investor deserve the full benefit of competition. The annual competitive shortfall could be worth $1.5 billion, money that could go into the investor's pockets. Gary Gensler needs to free the standard and drain the swamp so we can have the full benefit of competition and see which digital assets are really superior. XRP, the one and only digital asset bag that that'll want you in so they know what we hold we know what we hold gary genser do you remember on what you said about xrp gary genser we got you on that blockchain trail our pay is a bridge currency uh, our pay is a bridge currency a, a currency called ripple that you might hear in the banking sector oh it could be a currency even like uh, ripple has an alternative it's just pie our pay is they know what's coming we know what's coming and they can't stop it. Bank of America CEO keywords KYC AML transparency the last mile and let that ripple throughout the industry. Digital movement of money. One half the money moved by consumers today at Bank of America today is moved digitally. One half. This is not something new. When you get to an anonymous currency, that's a different question. And that's a policy question of whether we want an anonymous currency out there of size and scale and scope. And that's what the you start to see people struggle. Do you think we do? Do you think we want I, I, it? I, I don't think you want it. I think the reason why the $100 bill was the largest denomination of bills was to make money more difficult to move other than through a verifiable system. Mm -hmm. And I think that is a lesson a lot of economies have learned over time as they brought their denominations down to improve the transparency of the economy, mm -hmm. the ability to track it, the ability to find the money, the ability to have it come through in that huge AML and KYC work we do, and the industry does. And it helps you f find all kinds of interesting things, and, and that's important for law enforcement and other types of things. So it, I think that that's not, the speculation I'll let other people reflect on, mm -hmm. you're seeing great debates on it, but I, I think you know the idea of digitizing money is not new. The wire system is a digital transfer mm -hmm. system, mm -hmm. the ACH system. The question is, what's exciting is when you can walk around Bryant Park out here and go in these little shops that are set up for Christmas and be able to tap your phone or something like that as opposed to being carrying dollars. Those are exciting things. And to get that last mile electronified, that's what to have you and I exchange money if we had lunch together through Zelle. That's, mm -hmm. that's exciting. That takes the cash because in the end of the day, of the $53 billion expenses on round numbers we'll have next year, five of it will be to move coin, currency, and checks around the system. Mm. And if I can take that down in a safe, verifiable ability to do it, know your customer in AML, take that down. That's a very valuable thing for us. And then just ripple that through the industry. And we, we used to quote that we could ask them to destroy every we could We could pay them to reprint the money rather than have to cycle back in and out because it was cheaper to move it around. Now, some of our contracting parties have moved around. Let that ripple throughout the industry. Get ready for the last mile crawl walk. Then we rock it. Download the last mile playbook through the global payments all running on the XRP ledger. Speed, transparency, and liquidity are critical for efficient payment processing, cross-border transactions, and all worlds lead to the bridge. XRP, the interoperable one, the last mile. Stellar says picture a world where positive change is just a project away. Join the SCF awards and submit your innovative ideas for the Stellar Sorobin ecosystem and request up to 150,000 worth of XLM at a time. Willy Wonka XRP must watch. Pierce's XRPL development going extra, extra strong. Your Pierce's contributions to XRPL Ledger has been like. Join us. We started the year by designing the XRP stamp. The first digital notary on the XRP ledger capable of generating digital certificates on any documentation. We were quickly able to implement this solution with the Colombian government's National Land Agency. Creating the first decentralized land registry launched into production nationwide. XRPL technology is fantastic, but we wanted to help expand its functionality to provide a broader foundation for the future. And after months of research and dedication, together with the Ripple team, we launched the first EVM-compatible sidechain with XRP ledger in a DevNet version, along with a bridge to transfer XRP and an explorer to check its activity. The XRP stamp was still going strong, and we signed an agreement with a Honduran digital notary to implement the XRP stamp in 2023. Not only that, but we were surprised to see that the Colombian land registry was selected by the prestigious Time magazine as one of the best innovations of the 2022. What an honor! We didn't want to end the year without making a contribution to the long-awaited NFTs on XRPL. So we launched XRP Studio as a result of a grant to have an optimal platform for the partnerships and collaborations we are doing. And of course, ending the year with a new version of the Rockstar product 
updating the EVM sidechain with better performance and consensus. The XRP Ledger is the far superior technology. It's no wonder Ethereum and Bitcoin needed some more help from the SEC. Know what you hold? XRP continuing to build, continuing to expand, and we're just getting started. Riz XRP says pay attention. Japan, not playing around, ready to set XRP on fire. John Dean says, I have no doubt Ripple will win and the Supreme Court will shut down the SEC Gov's gross overreach. The West Virginia vs. EPA case is all you need to read to agree with me. Ripple's summary judgment brief is already an extremely well-written brief. That's because we got the A-team, we got the evidence, and we got the superior tech. Get ready to watch the SEC fall. XRP Studio says we're excited to announce our first world-renowned artist launching on XRP Studio, presenting the collaboration of a lifetime with artist Lorenzo. Lorenzo will be back in his legendary sculptures on the XRP Ledger with digital NFTs. Stay tuned. At the case says very cool podcast with the real Super Mojo CEO, the real vision for NFTs and finance, backed by Ripple and others. Super Mojo is at the front end of the next phase of NFT finance, often discussed with the XRP Ledger in sight as well. Also, don't miss this announcement on XRP.com says they're excited to announce the partnership with Real Super Mojo to enable credit card payments and leverage their custody solutions through our XRPL NFT marketplace. Accessibility is the key to the mass adoption. Yeah, payments for NFTs enabled that XLS 20. Agra Crypto DXY rejection line. DXY got rejected on the three day and now trying for the second time to retest the rejection line. Closing above 105 is ugly, but getting rejected for the second time is bullish for the markets and cryptos. The low end of the linear regression channel is around 90, 92. Sentiment feed, it appears that the USD coin has played a key role in crypto's fluctuations, particularly since the FTX bankruptcy in early November. The amount of addresses holding 100k to 100 million USDC by 2001, minus 7.8% in just the past two months as money shifted back into BTC. Get ready for all the money to flow through the XRP ledger. And with that being said, bag man and bag ladies, pick up yourself an XRP Army dog tag camo member edition. Select the year that you enter the xrp community also select the chain type bag man and bag ladies where will you be when those true bags of xrp are finally unlocked we'll catch you up here at the tippy top i am the xrp bag man the moon commander currently up here stuffing some bags and enjoying the show appreciate you stopping by tuning in smashing those likes for some more moon o'clock news hope y'all continue to stay extra extra bullish out there Continue holding those good vibes. Remember to sell the FUD, buy up those bags, and don't forget to spread that liquid love. Also, if you're new here, don't forget to drop a subscribe, drop a comment down below. All the OG diamond hands out there, drop a comment down below, drop an elbow on that like button from the top floor, and we'll catch you up here on the mothership for the moon party. BYOB, be your own bank, bring your own bags. Peace out, Crypto Ghost. We stole the show like a pirate Look at me now, you can't find me Big bags, I'm always smiling I'm always smiling Telescope, I know you spying I know you spying Moon crew, we all wildin', we all wildin' All that fud, you was lying You want a bag, why you crying? Why you crying? Why you crying? Rockets flying, rockets flying, crypto low, then we buy.